Here's an interesting example to understand direct variation better. Assume we have 5 light bulbs which are not lit. Each light bulb requires 10 watts of power to light up. So there's a box which shows you the reading of the total power supplied. For example, if 10 watts of power is supplied, one bulb will light up. Now think about it. What if 20 watts of power is supplied? Yes, two bulbs will light up. And if 30 watts of power is supplied? Three bulbs will light up. So you're getting all the answers correct. But what you may not know is the fact that this is direct variation. As more power is supplied, more bulbs light up. So what you're doing essentially is multiplying the total power by 1 by 10 to find the number of bulbs that are lit. This is the constant K that you come across in direct variation. So if the total power supplied is 40 watts, then the number of bulbs that will be lit is 40 multiplied by 1 by 10 which is 4. And similarly, if 50 watts is supplied, then 5 bulbs will be lit.